Yo guys, what's going on? It's your boy Chicago back with another video and today I got something different than just a boring ass ranked You know what I'm saying today? I'm going to be reviewing the envy versus the three-man pickup team of superstars in EU consisting of monkey moon uh, Itachi and astral three French speaking players um, So today's video I'm actually gonna do something different and basically if you guys know the inside of the mind of pro I do teams versus teams why teams won that series stuff like that but if you guys missed it last week, there was some NA versus EU beef, and it got settled by playing these uh, legit teams versus a pickup team. So in this case, NB versus an EU pickup team on any NA servers, just to basically prove that uh, NA is better. And today, I'm going to be showing you guys why. We'll be breaking down the game, but it's all good banter. It's all just speculation, right? But at the end of the day, NA is a lot better. You know what I'm saying? Uh, my NA boys got me in the comments down below. But anyways, let's get into this. So let's watch Miss Off Rip. You know what I'm saying? I honestly did shoot this game is 3-2 because I wanted to give you guys some action. I didn't want to just show like NA 2-0 in and it kind of been boring. So we got some goals in this game. But I'm basically going to be breaking down probably uh, why I think NA probably took the game and why I think NA is better. You know what I'm saying? Because you donkey cheeks. You know what I'm saying? Why do I keep saying you know what I'm saying? I'm, I got a problem. I got to stop. But anyways. So right now we got the usual miss kind of safer rotations, you know, third man. As a lot of people know, misses. He's a lot more of a safer player, I guess, compared to like an atomic who's aggressive, and turbo is just everywhere. It's right here again. Demo off rip. That kind of that little one demo off the challenge was just kind of lucky. Set up this entire possession slash passing play, and then here comes turbo reading. EU's clears. EU with a double commit. It's just gonna start the anaconda. EU's panicking. Their defense is panicked. They don't got the good comms. Pickup team, mind you. But we're just going to save for the sake of it. Panicking. Turbo comes in. The demos, they're constantly flowing for NA. The pressure, the Anaconda, it's constantly being held on the pickup players right now. That's what I'm just going to call them, by the way. The pickup players. Or E, or Frenchies. Oh, as I say that, NA absolutely double commits. Miss right here. Absolutely 500 IQ. So he knows Monkey Moon's up with him right here. So he knows that he's also first to the ball. So instead of just trying to beat him and getting dunked by Monkey Moon, what is he going to do? He's going to obviously dip his car like we saw. And he's going to play low. And he's going to get the free dunk over Monkey Moon. Absolutely 500 IQ. That NA brain, you know what I'm saying? It's the 2v2s, the NA mechanics. They got that muscle memory. But basically right off rip, honestly, you can tell that NA's aerial mechanics... Or aerial pre presence, spe specifically with Envy, is a lot stronger than EU's, right? I think that's a lot of the argument is NA's mechanics, EU doesn't really... As I say, that miss probably goes for ball. He thought someone was behind him and he gets absolutely dusted by Astral. Just unlucky, but miss probably felt really pressured to go there since he was last man. And if he just sat in that, it would be too hard to save. And he doesn't have enough boost to turn, beat Astral right here. Astral's in the better position and gets kind of dusted. But it was just kind of tough because both the teammates were up there and he couldn't really... It was just a tough situation. Astral played it well and just got the dust on him. But up until that point, what I was saying is the NA mechanics uh, are basically the biggest like conversation between EU and NA and the difference. And especially like the defense. A lot of people say EU's aerial defense is a lot worse and that's why um, those mechanical players are so much more successful where in NA it's probably a lot harder. And I agree with that. I think NA probably gives less space... You got to do more with the ball. You got to be more creative than EU. And that's one of the main points why I personally think NA is better. Just because a lot of the game in the air is just a lot more dominant in terms of NA side. But uh, let me know what you guys think. Because I'm actually curious to know if you guys, what region you guys think is better. And for what reason. Like let me know if you think it's certain rotations. If you think it's a team to team basis. Uh, I'm curious what you guys have to uh, say. So just let me know down comments below tweet at me something so follow me on twitter by the way all right right here so miss like this is what i'm talking about in eu the person would go straight back to net and wait for their team but miss absolutely just straight up knows he's getting demoed knows he has to jump so instead of like going back and waiting to get demoed and and like the inevitable would just be him keep getting chased until monkey moon scores an easy air dribble he jumps early reads monkey moon outplays him in the air and then itachi's last man panics in the air because he doesn't expect turbo he's like why is he here because they're not used to that pressure probably that a lot of teams in EU might give so turbo's just right there and itachi since he that little second of hesitation is what led to that goal 
and especially in pro rock league in general no matter what re region hesitation is literally just gonna kill you right but anyways let's continue atomic with the aerial flipper set tr almost like triple commit out of you but Ashwell does a good job clearing it miss does a good job waiting playing a good 50 again reading them oh my god but look at the reads they're crazy well let's go to atomic we've been on miss the entire game let's switch it up and go to atomic because atomic's kind of got the opposite not the opposite play style but a little bit of a different play style than miss but right now honestly it could be because of the ping again this is all speculation but if we're assuming stuff we're gonna take it as it's serious right now you can just tell a little bit of the aerial presence as well as just like these reads and these challenges on a on na side are just a lot stronger than you so there's no question about that like anytime you tries to make a play envy's either reading it they're challenging it or they're they're just straight up winning it you know and it's successful for them right there missed with some really good job carrying the ball and look at atomic just lurking he's just lurking for the ball to come to him because then he's gonna strike and you know create offensive chance it's right here again good challenge forces monkey moon to go over atomic interesting way of getting back to net but whoever gets the job done you know what i'm saying but anyways honestly questionable right there absolute disrespect out of atomic so right here in my opinion i actually thought atomic is gonna watch mid pass because there's no one watching mid for envy so usually the idea is you want to always have someone watching mid and then someone on backboard to play high because that way you're just going to cover more angles more threats are going to be covered just by one person playing mid and then one person playing backboard so i thought right here since miss is on the up, up field and turbo just hit the ball and he's going to grab this back boost that turbo would go backboard and uh atomic would watch mid but i guess atomic was probably scared of the shot um straight away so he just went back to net and then he absolutely i i think this is just disrespect he's like a, Ashwell thinks he's gonna hit this so instead he's just gonna let it go and have a free dribble just like this i think it's since he's low boost can't really do much since atashi played really high so he had to go for a 50. gonna get some pads make sure to not waste boost for no reason a little bit of a double commit again this not the greatest game you've ever seen from enemy but they're playing how they're usually do and they're doing really good at it they're passing they're just doing everything really solid a few double commits here and there and right there there's just the na presence turbo dishes out mid atomic with a perfect first touch he gets a lot of power in a second the ping's got to be a little bit hard to save that but basically you know you know the drill and uh i mean we got to go to the big turbs finish off the game turbo the the former eu now na king himself i don't know i think he said he considered himself na which is a big dub for na you know what i'm saying if turbo's like nah i'm na now instead of claiming easy EU, because turbo moves regions wins a world championship then plays against his foes on ping and absolutely destroys them foros them this is a foro by the way and if you guys want i have another game after this uh one more replay so if you guys want to see that one too and you liked it and you want to see the difference and me talk about it more again let me know maybe like the video that'll let me know if this if the video goes off i'll definitely do another one that's for sure but monkey moon i'm sorry he peaked he peaked what can i say there's not much more to it than other than the man peaked mickey moon you know what i'm saying no uh, but uh, just a crazy shot honestly literally perfect not literally not much you can do there for envy just absolute peakage right there you never happen again you know what i'm saying that never will happen again for you Especially against NA. And we got to watch the GOAT. Turbo slinging the ball downfield. Eve's nervous. Turbo with the big 50 dub. And now he's going to cut because he sees Miss going all the way back. Probably calmed it too. So that way he's going to cut. He's not going to go all the way back for boost. He's going to stick. Control the midfield with just the pads that he grabs. EU brain. Five head. Basically, kind of some boring overtime stuff right now going on. Classic fake. Just like, look at Turbo, getting the pads. All he needs is two, right? And he's going to boom this ball, get over to Atomic, miss triple man passing play, miss fakes it, absolutely outbrain to Tachi. Mid Turbo not wasting boost, just lurking mid because he doesn't have to do anything else. Probably didn't expect Ashle to recover that well. And then there's a triple commit from uh, the, the Frenchies. And Ashle with not the greatest touch and misses uh, position is perfect, you know? But anyways, if you guys enjoyed that video and you'd like to see something like that again, 
or if you guys have different ideas of what you would like to see from me in general, let me know down in the comments below. But anyways, that's going to do it for your boy. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe. It's free. I'd greatly appreciate it. And I'll see you guys later. Have a great day. Peace.